Hi everybody, in this video I will show you how to create a Spark application with Scala using Maven or IntelliJ. This video is based on an article that I wrote since time ago uh, in, my, in my blog, now they mention, and you can check it from here. Uh, as a, as a prerequisite we need to have installed a Scala plugin in IntelliJ. This is really easy. Uh, you need to go File, Settings and in Plugin section just put the Scala. If you don't have installed you need to go to Browse Repositories and you can find here. Uh, the plugin is Scala. Uh, this is the, the plugin. You just need to install it and that's it. The second thing, uh, I have the final result here but I will show you how to how to create application from scratch. You need to go to project and in Maven section uh, tick create from, from market type and search section name it or Apache or Apache Scala uh, here Scala tools archetypes Scala archetype simple next group ID let's put something like comes uh, my company you can put here what you want it and let's put the Scala and the name of the artifact let's name Scala example uh, next In the name of the project, we can put just project Scala or project Spark. Uh, let's change the location of the project. Let's put in a different place. I will create a folder here name it Spark example and I will choose this folder and just finish let's put in this window I just will enable a Maven auto import in order to allow the the, the new dependencies be downloaded as as I wrote here in the in the POM in the POM file as you can see this is running downloading all the needed uh, dependencies I will post the video here and I will return when all dependencies and this uh, POM file be autocomplete here the download have finished and the, this file the POM the POM uh, was autocomplete with all the needed dependencies and plugin repositories and plugins we need to do some changes here uh, look at this this URL uh, was auto created in when you create the project but the thing is that this uh, URL is not available it, it doesn't exist anymore as you can check it here yeah uh, this will return a, an error uh, 404 the page doesn't exist or, or the URL the URL doesn't exist anymore so we need to remove this and and these two because point to the same URL we don't need any more this but we, we, we need to find a, a workaround here what we need to do here is just add new two new dependencies. One of them is this Maven Scala plugin. This will allow uh, manage all the Scala Scala things on Maven. Let's add it on our POM. Let's put here, for example. You can uh, choose a different version. I will choose to. 11 and the other one that we need is Spark Core Spark Core dependency I will add it here and that's it 
Now I will change this property Scala version uh, instead to use 2.7 I will use 2.11 I had some troubles when I was trying to, to run this with uh, 2.7 so I choose change to 2.11 if you want to try with 2.7 you can do it and now I will run this application in the terminal using just uh, the terminal of IntelliJ I will run this command maven or mbn clean package and we have some error here this is related with this uh, this this object uh, which is added when you create a project I will remove from here this and the and the related test in the test section I will remove these two files we will create test file here but from now let's let's remove it let's run again and now we have the, the, the project created in Maven uh, with the Scala language on IntelliJ uh, in the second part of the video I will show you how to create a really simple application uh, to, to test the, this project I hope this video would be useful for you please subscribe to my channel and see you later